Okay, let's discuss uh, EDK to source tree. So on the screen, on the left side, you can see uh, the main directory of EDK to uh, source tree, and uh, and from the top, you can you can figure out that there are some ARM packages, there are some ARM platform packages, ARM virt packages, and many others like you can find crypto packages, network packages. Um, there are there are first of all there are packages and there are also some other directories like base tools or conf which we will discuss in details uh, on further slides uh, on in further sections and subsections typically as you can see the uh, the name of the directories in in main main direct main source tree of edk2 is is finished with pkg and um, what is inside this uh, this PKG uh, package UFI package? We can find uh, based on example on the right side where we see UFI payload package. Uh, here we got some modules inside uh, like BL support Dixie, BL support SMM, and various others. Uh, there are some also some includes some libraries. Uh, and what is most important are all those are, are those files uh, DSC, DEC, and FDF on the bottom. Uh, the DEC and DSC files are needed to define package. Those are uh, special files which got their own uh, specification as, as ev every other file in EDK2. And uh, those files define what's inside the package. Uh, and uh, we will discuss later um, how, how those uh, files are created and used. So how things look inside the modules. So uh, we in, in the EDK2, we have packages. In the packages, we have, we have modules. And on the bottom, we have a list of uh, SMM access Dixie module. And this module contains uh, three files. First is a C source code. Second is a header. And third is an in file. 